I'm going to show you how to make my lemon puddings. It's not lemon pudding, but pudding. It's a mix between a souffle um, and a lemon pudding. And the fantastic part about this dessert is that it's a skinny dessert. So there's no cream, there's no butter, but still it rises like an amazing souffle and tastes yummy like a moist lemon pudding. So we're going to start by separating our eggs. So I'm going to bring out two eggs. Um, so we start with the egg yolks, we just give them a little bit of a stir and then we'll add the lemon juice, then the lemon zest, uh, then we'll add the sugar and you just whisk it using your hand so that you partially incorporate, beat it as much as you can but it's alright if you can still see the sugar granules. This is a really fast, simple dessert, but it looks so elegant. It's excellent to serve when you have company coming over. You can totally stun your guests with it. So now the sugar is more or less uh, dissolved. So I'm going to add in the flour. Just want to fold it in as well. flour is mixed in, I'm going to add about half a teaspoon of vanilla essence. And I'm going to give it a good stir again. And then I'm going to start adding the milk. You can just pour it all in once and then you just have to make sure everything is really well combined. Once you add the milk, it will just become easier to stir. And that's it, we're done with this bit of the recipe. All we need to do now is stiffly beat the egg whites and incorporate the two mixtures together before we pop them in the oven. I'm going to start beating the egg whites now. You need to beat them stiffly, so you need to use an electronic beater. So let's get started. So I'm going to add a little bit of salt. It just helps beat the egg whites really nice and stiff. almost done now as you can see there are peaks that are forming in the egg whites which means they're really nice and stiff now so I'm going to take it inside and we're going to move forward with the next step I'm going to add the egg whites that have been beaten stiff gently into the egg yolk mixture so you can do it in three or four batches and all you need to be careful about is that you don't take out all the air that you have incorporated into the egg whites so you fold in one direction and you use very gentle pressure with your hands and it's alright if you can still see white bits you don't have to squeeze everything out I'm going to add the other bit and again very gently with your hand you just incorporate everything into the egg yolk mixture very gently and the last bit goes in now So what happens in this dessert um, is because we've beaten the egg whites so stiffly, uh, a cake layer is formed on the top of the dessert and below is a very lovely moist lemon flavored pudding which is why this dessert is so fantastic. So this looks nearly ready. 
You can still see a little bit of white and yellow which is separate but don't worry about it. It's more important to keep all the air inside that to just really mix it well. So we are done here now. So I'm going to preheat my oven at 180 degrees Celsius and we're just about ready to pop our little ramkin tins. You will require ramkin tins for this dessert because it just looks so elegant and beautiful in these particular uh, containers and I'm going to start by buttering them so you just want to lightly butter the inside so I know I said there's no butter in this dessert but this is really negligible it's just that it helps in making this pudding rise really nice and evenly and we're done These are ready to go into the oven and before they go into an oven you need to put them in an oven proof dish and create a water bath. So I am going to pour some hot water just so that it comes up till about half way up to the level of the ramkin. So this is just about perfect. You want the water to be at about half way up of the containers and these are ready. They go straight into the preheated oven. My oven is at, is at about 180 degrees centigrade. And these will bake for about 25 to 30 minutes or until they are well risen and brown on top. <laughs> 